Well, the cold air is going to be sticking around and now we're going to throw into the mix the chance for a bit of some rain and snow, possibly mixing together at times. Here's a look at your Sunday. We'll start out into the 30s, just about area wide, farther inland, some upper 20s tomorrow morning, but highs into the 40s by tomorrow afternoon, mainly into the low to mid 40s. We're currently sitting at 39 in Milwaukee. The winds are light out of the north at three miles per hour and it's 33 in Watertown, already hitting the freezing mark in Beaver Dam and 38 currently in Port Washington. We're tracking a cold dome of area or, or I should say cold air that's going to be working its way out of Canada and pushing farther south into our area. Along with that, we also have some moisture that'll be working its way out of the Rockies and pushing farther eastward into our area. The combination of those two things will give us a chance for seeing a bit of a rain snow mix, possibly off and on throughout the day tomorrow. We've already had a couple of reports of a few flurries in Dodge County, but the rest of us are dry. So here we are after midnight and seeing a little bit of light sprinkle activity. It's a little bit overdone, but there will be some moisture in the air. We could see a few sprinkles, some flurries later on tonight. Tomorrow morning, some light rain near the lakefront. That will continue off and on throughout the day. And here we go heading into the afternoon. Some snow mixing in at times. And late tomorrow evening, as temperatures begin to get colder, we could see a little bit of light snow, especially farther west and farther north. Now from Port Washington southward, it looks like it's mainly going to be all rain, but at any rate, not expecting any way in the much of accumulation with this, but on the grassy surfaces, you could see some trace amounts of snow, especially for Dodge County, Fond du Lac County and the northern half of Sheboygan County. For the rest of us, we're just looking at a couple of hundredths of an inch of rainfall, so this really is not going to be a major event for us. Nonetheless, just something to be aware of as you're out and about tomorrow or hitting the roadways. 33 for tonight, upper 20s farther inland with some sprinkles or flurries possible than 43 for tomorrow with a bit of that wintry mix. The Packers, they're going to be kicking off at noon tomorrow against the Houston, Texas in Houston, Texas, and temperatures will be warm as they open up the roof into the lower 80s. 43 for tomorrow for us, 41 on Monday, and we're back into the sunshine for the rest of the week with highs in the upper 40s and lower 50s.